In this video, I'm going to show you the best coverage defense in Madden 23 right now. It comes to us out of the 46 defensive playbook. And if you're watching this video and you want to get my full 4-6 defensive ebook, specifically my dollar defensive ebook, I actually have two different versions of that. You can get both of those by joining the Patreon. The link is down in the description. Now, what we're going to do for this coverage defense is we're going to turn our auto alignment to base. We're going to put our ball and air defense on play receiver. Our option defense is going to be on conservative. Our zone drops, our flats are going to be at 30. Our curl flats are going to be at five. And we're going to turn our zone coverage to match because match coverage is just the best way to play zone uh, for the most part in this game. Now, the other thing that's really important about this tip is in our coaching adjustments we are actually going to turn our auto flip off um, and the reason is because for this setup you are going to be manually flipping your play um, depending on these critical rules that i'm about to cover so the number one rule in zone this year is essentially what you want to do is you want to play cover three to the wide side of the field and cover two or cover four to the short side of the field. Now, I have the Washington Offensive Playbook um, on, uh, and I'm going to show you one big reason why you have to be a little careful with that general tip. It's because of the play clear out FLN. So, if I was to come out in this play, let's just say I come out in cover two, um, and I want to play double Mabel coverage, right? So, I'm just going to purple both of these yellow zones, and then we're going to drop this guy into a deep blue. And what you're going to notice is on the right side of the field, this is going to play really, really, really well. The coverage is going to do exactly what we need it to do, and it's going to be hard to hit really anything over the top of the defense. However, if I move the ball to the short side of the field, where I would, where I just said run cover two to the short side of the field, you're going to see one big problem with that with this specific playbook. So you see here, I've got my double Mabel coverage set up. And what you're going to notice is if I uh, call this play with cover two, that half defender is going to get shredded up the seam and it's going to be a big play for your opponent. So this is why I personally want to recommend to you this little tip that I like to use out of dollar and that is a cover three cloud approach. Cover three cloud approach, basically what this does is it's going to play essentially a cover three on the wide side of the field and then a cloud concept on the short side of the field and if you take a look at that zone at the top right hand corner of your screen you're going to notice that that zone is an outside third so as it's a little bit different it's going to play a little bit different than a deep half will so what you're going to notice here is to the wide side of the field, we're going to run that cover three. But now to the short side of the field, we're going to run this cloud concept with that safety in an outside third. This is going to allow us to not only double or not only Mabel the bunch side or the short side of the field, but with a with a 30 yard cloud, a five yard curl flat. But now we also can have a, a yellow zone in that area. And then we are free to use her here and basically look for any kind of deep crossing route or anything to the left side. So we're going to run that same exact concept that was bombing cover two for a one play score. And what you're going to notice is that this third is actually going to run with him really well. And the KO ability is going to now be close enough to actually be able to make a play and knock the ball out. So the, really the only thing you need to remember with this defensive setup, though, is what I'm about to show you um, with auto flip. So if the ball is on the left hash mark, the rule of thumb is we want to run the cover two side or the cloud side to the short side of the field. So in this example, you notice that the cloud side is to the uh, wide side of the field. So if my opponent was strategic, they would maybe flip their bunch to the short side on me and they would run this corner route to the left side. And we know this year that short side flooding concepts are really, really effective. As you can see there, the corner route is wide open. However, if I was to flip this play and I had my setup like so, and then all we did is we're just gonna manually back off. Um, we're gonna manually back off these outside guys, right? So, you know, you might need to do some other things, but basically just back off your outside cornerbacks. That's the, one of the other keys to this. Um, and now you're going to see they're going to try to run that same basic thing, right? And we are free to use her in the middle of the field. Uh, the biggest thing I just want you to see is primarily how this corner route is going to get played. 
Um, the rest of things are, you know, kind of suspect to change. But anyways, you'll see here, now they try to throw that corner out. And as you can see, we have a cloud flat right in the area in which they're trying to throw the football. To me, this is probably, I think, arguably the most dominant coverage defense if you can understand the principles. And the principles are, we want to play cloud coverage to the short side of the field. Uh, so what I like to do is I actually like to put the cover three cloud into my audibles. I'm going to show you why. And we're going to actually come out in the DB fire too. This is going to give us the same pre-snap look. Now, the thing you need to understand is your auto flip is off. So you're in complete control of which side your cover three cloud is going to be. So in this example, the short side of the field is to the left side. So I'm going to flip my cover three cloud at the play call screen. And then I'm going to come out in DB fire. And I want you to see... Uh, what this actually ends up looking like uh, when we do this. So you're going to see here that I still have the DB, I have the DB fire. So that cornerback on the right side automatically comes up. Now, when I audible to cover three cloud, all I need to do is manually press the slot. And then from there, I can, you know, adjust my coverage, right? So let's say we're going to do something very simple like this. And now my entire defense is set up. And the beauty of this is it actually gives the illusion that I'm in DB fire too. So now let's say they try to throw the C route uh, with the motion over streak. This is a very popular setup right now. Do something like this, right? And they're going to block the running back because they're trying to pick up the pressure. What you'll see is that cloud coverage, is, the cloud is going to take the C route and the streak is going to get guarded by the middle third defender or the outside third defender, as you can see. So this coverage defense really is truly suffocating now if the ball was on the right hash mark which will show you what that looks like so let's say the ball was on this hash this this hash mark then what we're going to do is we're going to come back out of here and we're going to go back into the play call screen i want to show you what we're going to do differently so now i know that the wide side of the field is to my left side right so let's say that they're going to run their bunch to the wide side of the field and I'm going to come out in cover three cloud, or uh, I'm going to come out in DB fire, but I know that we're on the right hash mark, and I want that blue zone, that cloud flat on the right side there, I want that to be to the short side. So in this example, we don't have to flip our play. We're just going to come out in it just like this. When we come out, notice that DB fire pretty much does exactly what we want it to do, where it does what it would, it would have done even if it was auto flipped. Then we audible to cover three cloud. We press that slot that slot receiver um, or that cornerback and then we're just going to put that purple zone uh, to the right side and as you can see here don't worry too much about the pass rush um, we're just primarily focusing on the coverage but now this corner out to the wide side of the field you're going to notice that this um, you know this cloud flat or this uh, outside third defender is going to do a really good job of playing that route now let's just say that they're someone that likes to run their bunch to the short side of the field our adjustments are going to basically stay the same. We're going to audible to cover through cloud. Now, had they come out in this, we would have been properly aligned. So don't worry too much about it. But if you ever get in trouble, all you have to do is just press. And then what you're going to do is you're going to manually back off the short side cornerback, which in this case is going to be the guy to the right side of the screen. Okay, so now they're running their bunch to the short side. We saw that cover through cloud was, uh, or uh, that this was a cover two killer. And now we try to go to something like this. You're going to notice the corner routes covered, the seam streaks covered, and that route, that sneaky beater is also covered. So you're able to lock down the best zone beater in the game, and it's going to funnel them into having to take what you give them defensively. So this is right now one of my favorite, favorite coverages out of dollar. If you're watching this video and you want to learn more about the dollar defense and how to make it one of the better defenses in the game, make sure that you join our Patreon. That's where my dollar three, two ebook is full ebook explaining all the pressures, the run defenses, and all of the coverage schemes that you can do with a dollar. Thanks for watching the video. And if you want to check out that uh, defensive ebook, head down to the description of the video and click the link down below.